ahead and talk. Hey, what's up, people? Hey, guys. Alright, great. Go ahead and talk. Hey, hey, hey. How we doing? Right now we got EG and Dark Horse playing Combo Blaze and Lou. Double Falcon for uh, EG and Dark Horse. EG, sick Falcon player, and also Dark Horse, sick Falcon player combo. Very, very good at uh, the Falcon matchup in singles, but in doubles, it's a totally different thing. So, and then we have Lou playing uh, playing Ness. So, um, yeah. By the way, this is Atari. I uh, hopping on commentary today and this weekend, so looking forward to spending the weekend with you guys. This looks like a pretty rough matchup with uh, the Ness in here. Lou is uh, no slouch, but with Falcon, it's so hard because he's so fast. So if your movement's not on point, then uh, doubles can really just punish you. So that's a clean five for uh, EG and Dark Horse. I'm not sure if we'll see a switch or not. Earlier, uh, me and Professor Wizard, we played Combo and Lou in round one. They had some like Falcon Yoshi, Falcon Ness type of stuff. But uh, yeah, you're gonna watch. These guys are gonna do a really good job of switching off who's aggressive, specifically uh, Combo and Lou. So right now you see that the Ness was trying to stay back, but when the Falcon got started getting comboed, he had to come in and save him. So Ness does have a good edge guard on Falcon. You can either do that down smash like you saw him do, and if it whiffs, then you can just go in for another grab. So Falcon Ness is actually a pretty good team's composition if they aren't separated horribly. Because if they're separated horribly, then you can have two people getting comboed at the same exact time, not able to help each other, which is a little bit of what was just happening. So you see that the throw invincibility on Falcon doesn't come through, so he didn't want, or it does come through, so he didn't want to, uh, the Blue Falcon didn't want to hit his teammate. Um, but not the person grabbing it. So Luke gets a good down air, but again, teams not able to follow it up. Falcon kick, as you see. Lou loves that fast movement. And that's so scary as a Falcon against Nass, getting clipped by a forward air. Spacing. Again, you can see the grabs. You can see what both people want to do. Falcon wants to get a grab. Ness wants to get a back air into a grab. Back air into an up tilt. Back air into an up air. Unlucky. Doesn't get punished too bad. It's on the ledge, which is not the best spot for Ness to be, as you can see. It's uh, pretty easy to get games, pretty easy to kill yourself on accident. So you see the standard combo in the middle of the stage. That's why Ness is not as great a doubles character as other characters, because he can't get that vertical, that vertical height to help out his teammate if he's getting comboed like that, especially Falcon on Falcon. So we'll see him just leave the Falcon on the right to the Ness to get the edge guard because Ness has a great edge guard on Falcon. You saw it, it, it was just a split second where, nice, gets the bounce. I like that dash attack a lot to cover the uh, the bounce. So down smash, that's a great option too. It's such high percent, kill off the top no matter what. Can't DI it into the stage if you get the tip of it. Yep, down air, just like that. So this game is, they're up one stock, EG and Dark Horse, but the game's not over for sure. If they can get a good combo like that, exactly like that, just clipping. That's why Ness is so dangerous. He's such a volatile character on the edge because he can either get killed really easily or get an easy kill. So, racking up a lot of damage on player three. Combo is off stage. That player three keeps using that. Uh, oh, this could be it. Keeps using that. Uh, ooh, that's questionable, but the back air. The back air seals it. Came down to the 50 50 coin flip matchup, but. Yeah, you saw how volatile that, that Ness on the edge can be. He can either accidentally miss the edge because he doesn't have a great grip on it, like he doesn't latch to it very well and just die at super early percent, or he can get that down air spike at 70 that I don't think Falcon can even recover on. So again, you'll see them switching off Combo and Lou to see who's going to be taking stocks. You see there, that was a great pass from, uh, from Combo to Lou. See if there's any save shenanigans going on here. Nope. Lou just tries to take someone with him, knows that his recovery is not very good. I like that dash attack to try and save the nest. That was really good. Unfortunately, it didn't hit. So, right now, Ness is doing a good job. He's got amazing throw invincibility, Ness does. So, if he can get a grab, he definitely will choose that over a lot of different options. 
But uh, again, Falcon on Falcon is so difficult. Again, nice, nice pass. Great, great awareness by Lou. Now you still, you'll see combo, getting comboed. Uh, because Ness takes a while to recover, takes a while to get across the stage. Let's see if there's any uh, recovery shenanigans. I don't think he's dead. So, and that actually, he might have added more percent to it, but that actually helped the Ness recover because it made it so he could up be a little bit closer to the edge. Again, you see uh, Dark Horse, I assume, is player four, waiting until the throw animation is done so that he doesn't hit his teammate and can hit combo. So that was really good awareness again, just in the fast pacedness of this game, the awareness to uh, to wait until the grab is done. So again, Falcon stuff on Ness. The recovery takes so long. This is where you're hoping that your teammate can save you, but in Falcon versus Falcon, such a fast matchup, you can't always uh, you can't always get that help if your teammate's being occupied. So I like player four's uh, the Falcons attempt at the reverse back air, the little swag, but uh, didn't, didn't work. So yeah, that should be a kill, 100%. So they have a steep, steep uphill battle. You see the fast movement, invincibility still coming in. So yeah, this should be uh, this should be it unless Lou goes absolutely insane, which he might. Which he might. That's like the fourth Falcon kick we've seen in this set. Oh, just clips him. But uh, the hug. You see the grin on Dark Horse's face because he knows. Yeah, there it is. What a happy guy. It looks like this might be three out of five. If they keep playing, then it should be three out of five, right? Alrighty, let's see the adjustments that they make. Again, just the Ness going in with back air, getting stuffed out. Happened the first two games. Or the last two games, I should say. This time he doesn't get killed for it, but the combo is off stage and his teammate can't really help him. It's a pretty easy edge guard if, uh, if Ness is occupied. Let's see what combo can do here. Ooh, combo gets waffled. Oh, that was super lucky. Super, super lucky that combo didn't get killed there. But uh, unfortunately, they're both still alive. I did like the edge game that they had right there, so they could both kind of just hang out. Again, kills his teammate, but uh, gets combo as well, so they're up in stock still. Let's see, combo's using his invincibility so that he doesn't get hit by Ness's up B. That was super smart, in case he needed to cover his teammate as he's recovering. But uh, we'll see what the Ness can do. He's getting edge guarded, so combo just gets stuffed. If, uh, if the Ness could have uh, knocked player four away, then that could have been a totally different story. This game could be looking way different, but... Combo cleans it up. It looks like they don't even want to bother trying to edge guard. Super interesting. All right, this is a slobber knocker, dude. We'll see. Oh, I thought for sure Lou would convert off that one. They've been really good at that, but he converts anyways. Still able to get it. Lou's heating up. You can see his, uh, his movement. If combo can stay alive a little bit longer, I think, ooh, that's unlucky. He almost got the crazy, crazy DI, but he should take a stock here. That is the nice thing about Ness. He can kind of uh, stall like that. You saw the fancy, fancy little uh, uh, B tricks. So we'll see what Lou can do here. I think Lou wants to get a grab. Yep, because that'll set him up into that prime edge guard. But again, it's tough. Tough game. This game is hard. But Combo's going to take another stock, so you, you hate to see that. And that usually means things aren't going well if you're taking two stocks from your teammate. That means something's off. So I don't know what it is, but uh, I think that I think that their team was just a little confused as to who's aggressing when. Uh, EG and Dark Horse did a really good job at uh, kind of pushing them to the outside because Ness can't get from one side of the map to the other very quickly, and uh, Falcon can. So 